My name is Suzanne Morrison. I'm Marketing and Recruitment Manager at Armbre Academy. Over the next couple of months, we're periodically going to be doing some video blogs. Today, I have Ryan Shaw, a teacher at Armbre Academy. Um, Ryan, can you tell us a little bit about yourself and your time at Armbre? I've taught at Armbre for 10 years. I teach science and English here. I love it. Uh, outside of school, I have a young family, two daughters, and I'm an avid surfer and a, a writer. Uh, Ryan came to me with the um, subject matter of community activism and education. I thought it was a great start to our video blogs. Um, we all know that helping people is great, but what are some of the less obvious benefits to student involvement in community activism? The number one thing is that we get outside the classroom, so our perspective broadens. I see that with my students. And then I also notice that they become more proactive, less pessimistic about the issues. Um, they start thinking more critically and ultimately gain empathy in the process. And how, as a teacher, do you leverage that in the classroom? Um, it's all about ownership. So we decide on the community action together as a committee. And from there, we delegate to strengths. So some students are, are more confident in speaking publicly. Others make posters, uh, write slogans, or plan events. So we all, we all pull together for a cause. And what are some examples of Armbrae's involvement in community activism? Uh, we've had a yard sale to raise money for the Ecology Action Center. We have um, that we've done an awareness campaign for the Nova Scotia Nature Trust, uh, their 100 Wild Islands um, project. We've uh, designed and built a vegetable garden, and just last year we had a, a fundraiser for MOSH in the North End, a mobile outreach street health where a number of faculty shaped their heads to raise money. Excellent. And how do you personally relate your passion for your community to the classroom? So the slogan of Cow Bay actually is Cow Bay Love, and uh, I bring that into the classroom with me. I'm always talking about how much I love my community and I, uh, I organize concerts there and get the community together as often as I can, so trying to show students that ownership or pride in your community can uh, be a really positive thing. Great. Thanks so much.